let's examine problem 1258. This is a sell or process further problem. And these are also considered scrap or rework problems. They're very similar to those. And so I consider them basically the same thing. Andrews Antiques is an antique furniture dealer. Uh, it purchased a 1902 oak table from a client for $800. The table was in terrible disrepair. Andrews Antique dealer friend noticed the table in the back room and offered to buy it for $1,200 as is so we could sell sort of something junky right now or we can put some work into it ourselves that's seller process for their decision andrew thinks he may be able to do better if he puts some work into repairing the table he believes with 10 hours of employee work, $25 an hour, and $100 of supplies, the table could be spruced up and sold at a higher price. The company applies variable over at cost of jobs at a rate of $20 per direct labor hour. If all this is done, Andrew believes the table will sell for $2,000. Okay, let's just compare where we're at. If we take the deal today, we're going to make $1,200 on a table that cost us $800. We're making $400 dollars in profit in fact the, that original cost is not even a relevant cost because it's sunk it's not different between the options i'll include it here just to like you know as a number crunch but you'll see this 800 is is not irrelevant to the, this future decision uh in any event the second alternative is we can take two thousand dollars if we do some work on it and again that includes the 800 dollar cost that's why it's not relevant if we eliminate it from both sides we we'd come to the same conclusion but I'll, I'll keep it in there just for the conversation. So again, it's $2,000 table. We have $800 into it already. And we're going to invest, let's see, 10 hours employee time at $25 an hour, $250 in employee time, $100 of supplies, $100 of material, and uh, $20 per direct labor hour and variable overhead. And it's uh, uh, 10 hours, so $200 in uh, variable overhead. So where are we at here? Uh, 2000 minus 800 minus 250 minus 100 minus 200, 650. So we're at 650. If we take the money today, we make 400. If we do the work, we think we can make 650. There's a $250, let's see, determine the net dollar advantage and disadvantage of selling the table now. $250 disadvantage. to sell now processing further is a 250 dollars uh, better decision as far as this number crunch goes what are qualitative considerations andrew should be giving to this decision what other things should he be thinking about well there's definitely like value to having money in your pocket today you have no risk right maybe you start to repair the table and you realize there's termites inside and you just got to throw it out that's the other guy's problem. That's not your problem if you sell it as is, right? Um, so maybe you will lose a friend that way, but uh, certainly that's the truth. You no longer have the risk of the table. You also, uh, yeah, like these are all estimates. A lot of times you go, oh, it's going to take 10 hours and it takes 20. Well, you know, that risk resides with you that you're going to go over budget. Uh, you know, this is all about the future. Maybe there's no market for the table at $2,000. So that's a risk. Another consideration though, and us accountants are good at pointing out downsides. There's also upside here. Maybe when you've refinished the table, it's worth more than 2000. That's a possibility. This happens in the real world, right? You do work and you go, oh, this came out better than I thought. I got a buyer for this now beautiful oak table at $5,000. So, you know, there's a big upside obviously it's an attractive table if your dealer friend was like i'll give you twelve hundred dollars on the spot for this ugly looking table uh maybe uh it's actually better than we anticipated so those are all things i would be thinking about if i were andrew ultimately i probably would process further just given the the numbers right if i believed my numbers in my heart if i were andrew i'd say let's do it you know that's what we're in the antiquing business to do i would say let's do it uh but there you go we've solved 12 5a we want andrew to do it there's one thing i want you to do hit those buttons share it with your friends thanks for watching bye bye the next video in our series is right up here and if you want a supercut of all of the videos in this series that's the one down below